Good morning, good. Um, I too were okay, Dr. Chief. One of my co-guardians go under and tell us to Minister Keneally, I'm delighted to see you back in Harness. I keep it on this time of the note for whatever you do, don't have anyone try and attempt to it off, take it off you. You're very capable and engaging minister back even in the previous time I did for June 07 to 11 and, and uh, in between. And I wish you well and um, in the portfolio. Uh, regarding um, this piece of legislation, um, the, the, the transactions bill that um, Screening of Third Country Transactions Bill 2027, 2022, Second Stage, Department of Enterprise and Employment. Yes, I mean, foreign direct investment is a huge, has played a huge part of our, our, our country. Um, I can go back to Merckshire for Dawn, it's nearly uh, longevity, it's nearly there as long as myself. I, I remember the book and Oak when they came. A fabulous company and they're there uh, 50, 50 years and more. And wonderful employment, wonderful company, and the huge numbers that are in foreign direct uh, investment, the huge employment, and the, the many, many plants. And uh, uh, I was going to mention, but I'll leave it to, to Haley Race, and they come in the Labour plant, and is what I know in, in, in the construction in, in, in Kerry, and many, many others who have done such gallant work. And it's interesting uh, to see, I suppose, uh, some people getting ready for government. It's great to see that we don't have a clamour anymore to get rid of the corporation tax from the parties of the left on my right, now, but the parties of the left. And indeed, <coughs> we had other um, parties, we still have other parties with clamour on a daily basis uh, with, with um, outdated ideas that these are anathema and we shouldn't be having them and it should be a, screen, a, a, a huge amount of taxation taken in. Now, I'm not going to um, 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 get involved in anything like that, but uh, we have to obviously have checks and balances as well. And we have to indeed uh, look after our, our, the perception now with the data centres is a very sad one because, you know, uh, when people are facing outages in electricity and the blame being apportioned to data centres, but they came in legally uh, through, our, um, through our, our, our mechanisms that we have here, probably enticed in, and uh, Europe, Europe are very happy to have them here uh, for a number of reasons, but we shouldn't be demonising them either because we want more of them to come and we want more of them to be able to stay here. But as I said, um, we have legislation, uh, very weak spots in legislation in many areas, but certainly uh, the, many of the direct uh, FDI companies I, did, I, I know of have good rec records. Um, and that wouldn't say that they're all um, impeccable, and we need to be having a close eye on them and to make sure that, uh, that, 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 that we're not just um, a dumping ground for, you know, for uh, off finance and everything else. But, um, and I mentioned Mark there, MSD. I would like to mention many of the employees that I know, past and present, and one very dedicated employee who uh, passed away recently, former employee, retired, was the late uh, George Kelly of Cap White, uh, Cundy Limney, and then uh, Kilsheel in Tipperdon. And George was a, a, a very active and engaging, well respected member of the workforce in Merckshire Perdome in, in, in Ballydine in Clanmel for, for years. And he enjoyed his retirement and played a huge contribution in the community he lived in as well, and in the, the, the Kilsheed and Tidy Towns, etc. But I would also um, hasten to continue that while we're passing this legislation here, we have members of your government, senior members, and indeed Taoiseach, Taoiseach going off out to World Economic Forums, going off out to Bilderberg Conference, some members of the cabinet, and regularly, and what's going on there, we have no legislation for. And the people are getting quite worried as to what and what, <coughs> who, we're, who, who we're serving here, and what masses we're serving. And I said this this morning as well, even though the Cahillac thought I was a bit, doing a bit of the theatrics, but it's fact, people see this. We're meant to look after our citizens of this country and not to be uh, cow town and doing what uh, wealthy, wealthy, multi billion pound um, uh, or dollar people with, with huge resources want the world to do and want us to be all good boys and sign up to it. So we need to look at legislation there and we need to have a, a record of uh, the travels and engagement. I questioned the teacher recently about what went on there. He, he wouldn't even, he didn't, didn't tell me, but he said, did say sovereignty wasn't discussed anyway. I wouldn't, on neutrality. Good, Margaret. Thanks.